Hello everybody, welcome to a Ponic Coaster video. And today we are back in the unnamed theme park. Yeah, we still not got a name for this place, but you know. So we are building the Infinity Coaster like we were last episode. But yeah, we're going to be doing some rock work today, some rock, you know, lots of rocks. As you can see, I've already started placing quite a few in. So what we're going to be doing, anyway, yeah, we, we, we're going to be doing some rock work and some supports as well. We're going to go in on the coaster and also we're going to do some theming around the area. No, I can't actually remember because I, I edited this video a bit, a bit ago, basically. Didn't do the voiceover, but now I'm doing the voiceover. I can't remember which, which video this is because I've got a couple of them for voiceovers to be done. Can't remember which one this is, so I think it's rock work supports and a little bit theming. Now, this did happen off camera, I think, but you can if you see I've put in another ride in this area, it's a flat ride there. So yeah, I put that in. I also think I might be um putting in another one. I don't know if it's this video or the next one, I don't even know if I recorded it, but there's another ride which is a sort of swinging spatial sort of thing. I was thinking of putting one of them in. Anyway, here we are, building the wall theming, like I said we would. I've still not bothered to change the tunnel on the launch, I want to redo that, but I've not got round to it yet. But, I will do it eventually, I promise. And, yeah, these are just supports. But these are pretty small ones. Hardly noticeable. Just around the helix. Is that a helix or is it just a turnaround? I don't even know, to be honest. I mean, literally, these are just one single support beam. This isn't exactly the most entertaining thing. I think this might be somewhat more... You know, interesting now. This one here. This one's a, not a, just a straight beam down. If, if, now, if you were watching before, you, you saw me put another landing pad in. You know, with a spaceship on it I built in the last episode. I put another one in. It, um, it's underneath the brake run. Now, I'm a bit stupid. I placed it underneath the brake run. Now, the brake for needs supports, so I ended up having to move the spaceship multiple times because uh, I couldn't fit the supports in properly. So yeah, I had to I had to sort the spaceship out. I had to move it, I think twice because I was a bit stupid. You can see it's just there underneath the brake run and the heart light row afterwards, which I did I did nick that straight from speed at Oakwood. It's also got a mid-course brake run followed by a slow hardline roll with lots of hang time. I thought, I think it's quite a nice element, so I just built it on my own ride. Yeah, here's me putting the footers in. Obviously, before I changed the terrain thingy so I can paint with these red rocks, because this is meant to be an alien planet. Now, it does look a bit like Mars. It is not Mars, because... I'm also going to put some vegetation in, some a little bit of it, just so it basically so it blends in better with the trees around it, so it doesn't look too weird. But yeah, here's me moving the spaceship. This was an absolute pain because it's, it's, it's there's quite a few parts in that spaceship, and I had to select it without selecting the platform because I can't move the platform because the pla there's a path there, so that's a deal with it basically and yeah I put this support in and I put the next support in and realize I have to move it again I think unless I'm misremembering this I haven't filmed this ages ago yeah here we go I think I moved the support a bit like this and try and get around it but it doesn't look very good it looks a bit off I think I'll change it in a minute might might have done it off camera I don't even know no, there's no more cuts in the video. 
just check the timeline. I, I came prepared to do this recording, guys. Am I gonna move the spaceship or what? I can't remember, honestly. Oh, here we go. This is very entertaining, this commentary. I should do more of these. Yeah, and then I also added a spine to the track or support or whatever. Because it, you know, it looked a bit weird. So I, I added that. I should probably change the core of those connectors. I'm going to do a bit more work on my break room support because I want to add a staircase as well because you'd have a staircase there to get down. Obviously, if the ride comes to a stop there because it is a brock break, if it comes to a stop there, we obviously want to be able to get down without having to get a cherry picker out and everything. That would be very, you know, inconvenient. And here's some more footers. So, yeah, I'm going to put the footers in. I also think we build a locker room. I think. I think. I can't remember if it's its own building. I'm pretty sure it's in that little. Uh, this building here, which isn't themed. This one. I think I put some theming on the outside and I turned the inside into a locker room. Oh, yeah, I put some chimneys. Kind of. They're not chimneys, they're pipes. And I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what any of these pieces are, they just look cool. But apparently, no, clearly not, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh yeah, sign, shopping area, plaza, whatever, I just, it's just some nice shops and a nice fountain. I don't know why I built it, it looks quite nice though. I spent a whole episode building it, that episode got about 5 views, so clearly people didn't like it. I mean, it's it's not. I mean, guests can't actually go up to the top bit, which is a bit of an issue. I'm just gonna make a ramp, but it doesn't. The grid system of the paths and the walls didn't line up properly. It was a bit annoying. So yeah, there is there is a staircase. It's just guests can't go up the staircase. It's a prop on the scenery piece. But here we go. I'm gonna make some lockers now and some art pieces. Oh god, these look a bit awful. I'm gonna be honest. But when, they, I mean, they're not that bad. I've definitely made words. I was trying to make the little, um, some handles or something. I don't know what I was trying to make. Just trying to make it look all right. I think these look a bit big. Actually, no, but no. I think I do end up making them a bit. I don't know what I was doing here because it's obvious that those are going to stick through the wall. Anyway, there's also that run this thing here, which I didn't think about when placing that. Basically, there's a load of stuff clipping into the building that was a bit annoying. There's a roof. This is all very interesting, isn't it? There's some floor. I think I changed that floor. Yeah, here we go. Putting a nice shiny floor just for the inside of the building. And then I think we also have a computer of some sort some to you know use the lockers you know you pay for the locker or scan some I, I, I don't really know oh yeah some stripes on the floor or some oh, those are very nice and there's the little oh no a bit more is that it and then sign locker the nice locker sign this all looks good and that is it. So, I hope you en you enjoy I hope you enjoyed the video. That's what I'm trying to say. You know, like, subscribe, join the Discord, do whatever, and I'll see you next episode. Goodbye, everyone.